Surveying the area, Sudan. lover from so long ago. Would I? The last house in Molden. All of should be here. They will attack on sight here. Built pail of water. Someone was in a hurry. Leave me be, warmonger! You have my sister! Is that not enough? Peace, boy. I'm not with these men. I came to speak with your sister, that's all. A day in Essex. Now here's a day riddled with strange portents and happenings. Why did they take your sister? Some of Alfred's men beat a child of the village for stealing bread. My sister would not stand by and see injustice done. Do you know where they're holding Olvida? Yet another stay at the King's pleasure. The prison camp at Brentwood, far to the west. I'll bring her to the lake house north of there. Meet us there if you wish. If you promise you will find her, I will. Then help us blow them. Yeah.
Stretch your wings, Sunan. I must be careful now. Hey, what? Show me. you I'll keep the rat busy <laughs> this must be Birsten's love Alvida they haven't broken her spirit
This key should unlock Albida's cage. One of them? Stay quiet. I'm here to free you. I cannot walk. My ankle. They were not gentle with me. Then I will carry you. Who are you? Who risked so much to save me? A friend. Of Ellerich's? Is he all right? The poor boy? <laughs> not your brother. Someone else who wishes to rekindle a, a friendship. Gentler, please. You'll soon be safe. Rest easy. My ankle. Oh, the pain. My bones ache. Bless the saints! Here you are, sister, safe and well. Rest now. Soon you will be up and about again. Alfida! Did they hurt you? Takes more than some cockshine milksops to break my will. Beating a boy after death for stealing bread? I'll not see it done. Growling bellies mean nothing to those pay swords. Ellerich, pay more mind to the world. It is cruel and dark for those who cannot stand up for themselves. Alvida, could we speak in private? He is a good boy. But without a father to guide him, he's grown softer than I'd hoped. You raised him alone. Where were your parents when he was a child? Dead of the plague that came when he was three months born. So to shun your door when you have a babe on your teeth. Now it's your turn. Why did you come for me? I am here at the request of Elderman Beerston. He wonders if you could love him again. Love him? Dear old Beerston, he remembers. He does. I've thought of him sometimes myself. But with my brother to fend for... I could not waste a life mooning. He has thought of nothing but you, Alvida. And with his wife, Estrid, returning to Frankia, he sent me to find you. How it would work between me and him? I'm a poor woman. Have been always. 
But the Elderman... Oh, God, help me! I'll give him a go. How could I not? Oh, bless. He'll come if you call. At the lighting of the bonfire, he'll ride here to meet you. Ellerich, come you and sit with us. I have something to say. My... my apple blossom girl. Is it really you? It is. Though crows have left their footfalls around my eyes. They still shine brightly, as when we were children. Has Eivor told you all? Aye, she has. And do you accept me, love? My heart feels like it will burst. And this young lad is Elderich, Olvida's brother. Hello, your... your... worshipfulness? I am Beerstan, nothing more or less. And you are a fine, strong lad of... how old? Nineteen summers. He's all the family I have, Beerstan. If I'm to stay, you must welcome us both into your heart. We have one half of our bargain done, Beerstan. I will return with news of the other. Does this mean we're leaving Malden? You are, my boy. To live with me in Colchester. Perhaps I can teach you the joy of the hunt. Before you go, Elleridge, I'd suggest a long, slow walk around the lake. Now to plan the kidnap. Estrid waits for me. Dear Beerston, I cannot believe you would come for me after all these years. I never stopped thinking of you, Alvida.